Hello everyone, welcome back to MathMo. Today we have an interesting equation. We have 256 to the power x equal to 1 over x. Of course, this is the hard one equation because we have exponent and we have the same power in our denominator. So this is hard one, but I want to show you how <coughs> we can solve it easily. Take a look. If we raise both sides to the power 1 over x, what we will have? We will have that 256 to the power x on the left we raise to the power 1 over x. And we do the same on the right. We will have 1 over x raised to the power 1 over x. So we just raise both sides to the power 1 over x. What we're going to do next? We need to know the rule. If we have a to the power x raised to the power b, we can write it as a to the power x times b. So we just multiply our, our powers. And we can use this rule because this is the same situation. So we need to multiply x times 1 over x. We will have 256 to the power x times 1 over x equal to 1 over x to the power 1 over x. And as you can see, if we multiply x times 1 over x, it will be 1. So as a result, we will have our equation 256 equal to 1 over x to the power 1 over x. And take a look. On the right, we have same base and same exponent. We have 1 over x to the power 1 over x. On the left we have a number, but this 256 we can write as 4 to the 4th power equal to 1 over x to the power 1 over x. So as you can see we have same base and same exponent and same base and same exponent on the right. So this is still 256, but we write it in another way. So we have the our base equal to base and our exponent equal to exponent because this is one and only way that this equation works. So we have same base and same exponent and we can write that 4 equal to 1 over x on the right and from here x equal to 1 over 1 over 4 and this will be our, our root. Of course we can, we can check this root 256 to the power 1 fourth to the power x it will be fourth root of 256 equal to 1 over 1 over 4. And as you can see, this 4 goes to our denominator. We will have 4 on the, re on the right side. And on the left side, if you take fourth root from this number, we will have 4. So 4 equal to 4. So this root is, is good for us. If you still have any question, write a question in comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.